next word is the word saw. So, in the word saw, we have an S, which makes the S sound. Can you make the S sound? Okay, and then we have the letters A and W, and those letters are tricky because in this word, they're going to make the short O sound, ah. Do you make the short O sound, ah? Okay, so we have Ah, saw. Why don't you chop those uh, sounds with me and then we'll blend it. Ah, saw. One more time. Ah, saw. Good. All right. You use the word saw to talk about using your eyes in a time before now. Okay, so I'm going to read this sentence once. We're going to talk about it, and then we are going to um, read the sentence together. So, the boy saw the toys. So, since we, when we use the word saw, we're talking about a time before now. When do you think he saw those toys? He can't be seeing them right now, right? Because we're talking about in a time before now. Could he be seeing those toys tomorrow? No, because tomorrow is a time after now. So if we said the boy saw the toys, we're talking about maybe this morning he saw the toys, or maybe he saw the toys yesterday or last weekend maybe when we're talking about a time before now it's some some time that's already passed so we could say the boy saw the toys this morning but we couldn't say the boy saw the toys yesterday because that wouldn't make sense i mean sorry not yesterday <laughs> the boy saw the toys tomorrow we couldn't say the boy saw the toys tomorrow because that wouldn't make sense right Okay, so let's read the um, sentence together. The boy saw the toys. Good. So, in this activity, we're going to talk about things that we have seen. Something I saw that made me happy is I saw a rainbow. And uh, I don't know if you remember, but I brought the pictures of the rainbow to class and we talked about it. And we talked about how Jeremiah and I tried to find the pot of gold at the end of the rainbow, but we couldn't find it. All right. So after this video, I want you to tell your mom or dad or grandma or grandpa or aunt or uncle or whoever um, something that you saw that made you happy. I saw a rainbow. All right, and then we're also going to talk about something I saw that made me surprised. Look at that funny cat. He's very surprised. So, I'm going to tell you about something I saw that surprised me. So, um, a few days ago, Jeremiah and I were driving in a car, and I had uh, gotten a bucket that I was going to put, oh, excuse me, some papers in. And I turned around and looked at Jeremiah in his seat, and he, oh, let's see if I can fix this, had the bucket on his head. Oh, that didn't work out like I hoped. He had the bucket on his head. So let me just draw a bucket real quick. It was like this. So I couldn't see his face. It was just the bucket. I thought that was pretty funny. It was surprising. So when we're finished with this um, video, I want you to tell your mom or dad or sister or brother or grandma or grandma or grandpa or aunt or uncle or whoever you have there with you. Tell them about something you saw that made your face go like this. That made you very, very surprised. All right, before we go, we're going to um, make our sounds 
in the word saw. We're going to chop them and then blend them. All right, so we have saw, saw. Okay, one more time, all on your own, because you can do this. Great job today, guys.